You know what? Let's just tell them in person because they're here. Are they really? Yes. Raymond and John. What's up, guys? Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, man. And Raymond, I just cannot thank you enough for saving his life. Yeah, yeah, thank I you. I mean, <laughs> what amazes me is that you guys literally could be the difference between life and death, and then you get sort of, you drift apart, then you guys don't get to come back together the same way, and so we wanted to be that full circle for you and say thank you um, for everything that you do. And I do think this story is very important. Not everybody's, you know, got a girlfriend who lives at home who works in a hospital who would know what to do. Like, you guys are, you know, as professional as it gets in the life-saving category, and yet you're mortals who have to save your own lives. Absolutely. Um, yeah, you know, it's always about taking care of yourself, um, going to the doctor, monitoring your blood pressure on a regular basis, especially if you have like a strenuous job, um, and then just not ignoring the obvious signs. Sometimes the obvious signs are something that you might experience on a daily basis and think like, oh, I just have a little bit of indigestion. But if it just came out of nowhere, then just pay attention to it. Mark, please say whatever you're going to say. It's interesting, the... the the turnaround. I've, you know, worked with paramedics and, and EMTs, so uh, a real turn of events to be the one on the stretcher getting pulled into the ambulance. But, um, you know, again, I never felt like I wasn't in good hands. I mean, I, I can't thank you enough, you know. You know, we encounter so many patients on a daily basis, and the outcome is not always as positive. Um, but in this situation, even kind of like into the call. We didn't even know he was a firefighter initially. You know, really? We out he was a firefighter. Um, does that... Probably en route to the hospital. Oh, yeah. What um, does that do for your psychology, can I ask? Firefighters are heroes, right? And they save people every day. They are um, there in your time of need. And it's just nice that, you know, we are able to help in his time of need. So, yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. It's definitely a little more special when it's a co-worker. Yeah. You know? I understand that. I think so many people have so much more in common than we give ourselves credit for sometimes, just how much we're so utterly connected. Mm -hmm. um, and I think we want to take care of each other. We want to protect each other. But I think you all, the three of you, do it on a much bigger, deeper level because you live your life doing that. And I'm so in awe. <laughs>